Hi everybody, this is Jean-Charles Compagnon with the Kiwi Apps. Today I want to try to show you how to reset uh, an item score. Uh, you all know that if you search on uh, eBay, eBay uses an algorithm called Best Match and every single item has a performance score which is the ratio of sales versus impres impressions. So if you have an item that has had a lot of impression but not a lot of sales, that tells Best Match that this item is not really interesting to buyers, that they see it, but they don't click on it, and eventually they don't buy it. So your item then gets buried into Best Match and starts to go on page two, three, four, five, and pretty soon your item can't be seen. When you have an item like this item here, the cell phone booster that I sell, that I've sold for a long time, I've sold 351 of those, and I still have a lot of those, I don't really want to end my item and maybe for whatever reason, um, people have not been searching for this, so it hasn't been popular, and this item is not being found. And now my impression score or my performance score for this item is really bad, and therefore this item in search um, is not being returned very high. So I'm gonna show you how a little trick uh, that's, that is not well known uh, that you can use to reset that score and basically uh, throw back your item on eBay just like if it was a brand new item that you had just listed as far as the performance score goes. So what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to go and revise your item and the page is going to load in a minute and what we're going to want to do to force this uh, score to be changed is to change the category where our item is listed. So right now it's listed under signal boosters under cell phone. So I'm going to click change category and I'm going to make a note of this number here 68030. As a matter of fact I'm going to copy it. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to here just pick a category randomly and put my item in there. So I'm forcing it to be uh, revised to go there. It might get rid of my item specifics. My description is there. And I'm going to click continue. And I'm going to submit the revision. And by doing that, by changing the category, we've officially reset our um, performance score for this item. There are a few things that force a reset, and changing the category of the item is one of those. So of course, now we're going to want to put back the category where we were uh, in before, because we really don't want to sell it under nursing. And you remember that number that we copied here from before? We're going to now paste it right here and find category. And it's going to find our category right there, and we can change it back. You might have, depending on how you use your item, you might have to put back um, some of those. For example, the, the compatibility network. Uh, in my case, it's compatible with pretty much anything. And I'm going to have to put back um, the uh, brand, the model. I don't think there's a model connectivity and there's pretty much nothing else um, for me to add to this. So you might have, because you changed the category, you might have to reset um, all of those in the item specifics. So that's a little, you know, drawback of it. But once you're done and you put it back to the category where it was and you click submit again, so we really are doing two revision and okay it does not support this that's fine and I'm going to submit the revision and boom now we have a brand new item just like if I just listed it so it does not mean that my history is gone it does not mean that all of my scoring of this item is gone but the performance score which is a ratio of sell to impression just got reset and this is a brand new item as far as the ratio of sales to impression. 
So I hope that makes sense to some of you, and I hope that it will help some of you uh, try to revive some of your old items and potentially um, make some sales on it. Uh, once again, this is Jean-Charles Compagnon with the Kiwi app. We appreciate it. If you can uh, click like on the bottom and feel free to share our videos there for everybody to be helped. Thank you and have a great day.